A buckle is the kind of easy summer dessert that takes great advantage of the fruits of the season. And it's fun to say. Buckle. The batter for this buckle starts out with butter, and then of course sugar, because you have to have sugar. And then you just add flour, there's some lemon zest and some grated nutmeg, which adds flavor. You know, there's no one traditional buckle recipe that everybody makes. People make buckles according to what they have, according to what their grandmother made. It's the kind of thing that you make in the summer, it should be really easy, and it should have a lot of fruit. A buckle is part of a larger category of American desserts that also includes cobblers, it includes pan dowdies, brown betties, um, crisps, and all of the terms are somewhat overlapping depending on what part of the country you're from, which is very cool. What makes a buckle different from, say, a cake with fruit in it is the percentage of fruit. I want there to be so much fruit in this buckle that it's basically all summer fruit that's just bound with a little bit of buttery batter so that when you taste it, you're really tasting fruit and then the cake is secondary. When you fold the berries into the buckle batter, you want to be very gentle because you don't want to smash them up. You want them to be whole or as close to whole as you can get. You can use other fruit. You don't just have to use berries for your buckle, although then you won't get the alliteration. If you do a peach buckle, it doesn't sound as good as a berry buckle. You can use frozen berries if you don't have fresh berries. Just don't thaw them first because you don't want them to get too juicy. You want them to stay whole. And then now I just have some plain old granulated sugar. I'm gonna sprinkle it right on top. And that helps give us that buckled surface. It tastes good too. I tested a bunch of different buckle recipes when I was coming up with this. And my major tweak was to add even more fruit and then to bake it at a slightly higher temperature so that the surface would get extra brown. And now I'm gonna cover it up with a little bit of confectioner sugar. You could serve a buckle with a little bit of whipped cream on the side or some creme fraiche or some ice cream, but it's also really good all by itself. <laughs>